Now we can also uh, do a correlation analysis or get the correlation matrix. So we just call it correlation matrix and we use core data. And now we get a problem because not all data is numerical in our data sets. So see, if you see here, then we have numerical data except city. So what we can do is that we can um, just copy this like so. And we have data here and we would like to subset our data and we take all the rows, but we take certain uh, numerical uh, variables like price. Well, no single quotes. And we take square meters. And we can take bedrooms. So for example, oops, that was the wrong decision. So here we have a correlation matrix down here, where we have the correlation between price and square meters is positive 3.7. And between price and bedrooms is positive 0.21. And the uh, correlation between square meters and bedrooms is 0 0.91. And the correlation between a variable and itself is always 1 because it's the same variable. But here we have a lot of, uh, we have a lot of digits. We can actually round it with the round function. And for example, we only need two digits, which means that we have two digits here. It's much easier to read. So that's how you get the correlation matrix.